Well, that's happening, everybody. Welcome back to Ben Wright Reactions. Today we've got some more Bert Kreischer for you, talking about his daughters. Uh, we're just going to jump right on into this uh, and get some laughs. Like and subscribe if you enjoy this type of content. And here we go. You should know something's wrong to your children. Fuck that. Weird camera. Dude, I did not sign up for this responsibility to be a grown-up. I don't know if you guys feel the way I do, but just like growing up sucks dick. I like kids. I got two kids. I got two kids. I got uh, Georgia is 11, blonde hair, blue eyes, real smart, and uh, I got another one. Uh -oh. I don't know if you guys got one of those kids that was just fucking mess, like literally, like board cer certified messes, like. If it wasn't my kid, I'd be like, she's stupid, but she's mine, so I love her. Uh-oh. She just doesn't think right. Her brain, like, last, this morning, we're cuddling in bed. I, she's laying on my arm, laying on my arm, and she starts doing this. I go, what are you doing? She goes, I'm trying to soften it up. I go, it's my arm, Isla. I know, it's hard as a rock. Dyslexic. Dyslexic as shit. Oh, man. If you gotta Suck read it. with her, you can't let her read by herself because she just won't. She just won't. She, it's too hard. And I, your heart breaks, but I don't want to sit and read a book. It's your kid, man. I have a hard time reading, too. And then... Well... You got, she just sits there and looks at the word and then, like, tries to guess it off your face, like... Pterodactyl? <laughs> no, it's the Isla. Oh. Very few few books you're gonna read in your life are gonna start off with pterodactyl. <laughs> Crocodile? No, the car, Isla. The car. She's smart, just not like a useful to society smart. <laughs> Like, you'll never reap the benefits of her intelligence, I promise you that. Unless you got a dead body at your trunk at 2 a.m. There was an attempted kidnapping in a school adjacent to ours. And the teacher sat the kids down, told them they need a safe word. Isla comes home locked in. Dad, we need a safe word. I'm like, okay. How about Agnes? That's the street we live on. She goes, too easy. Smart kid. Too easy? Yeah, too easy. I go, why is that? She goes, Dad, they could guess that. I go, hey, Isla, if someone's guessing at our safe word, don't get in their fucking car. <laughs> now that's good parenting. I go, how about Priscilla? That's our dog. She goes, are you even thinking? <laughs> I go, what do you think it should be? She didn't even miss a beat. She goes, how about motherfucker? Be hard to guess. Think about it, Dad. No one's gonna say motherfucker to a kid. <laughs> oh, motherfucker it is, motherfucker. <laughs> and that was our safe word. Wow. <laughs> hey, I had to change it. I had to change it. It was too good. I knew I was taking it on stage, so I had to change it, but not before Stephen Fromkin had to pick him up. He's like, I'll get the girls. I was like, heads up, our safe word's motherfucker. He's like, I can't say that to your kids. I was like, good luck getting Isla home. He pulls up, Georgia jumps in the car like she's trying to get molested. Just... Isla's locked down, what's her safe word? She's known this guy eight of her nine years, what's her safe word? He's a guy that I know the safe word, it's a bad word, I'm not saying it out loud. She goes, then I'm not getting in your car. <laughs> he looks at her and he goes, the safe word is motherfucker. She looks at him in front of all the teachers and goes, I can't hear you. <laughs> Crazy kid. My daughters woke up at five in the morning. Five in the morning, they were younger. They were like three and five. Four and six. They they weren't wearing watches. So 
Okay. They wake up at five in the morning. Five in the morning. Five in the fucking morning. They're training to be farmers or some shit. <laughs> Either that or they're on a meth lab out of the closet. I don't know. All we hear is them laughing hysterically on the baby monitor like two homeless guys that just found a 20. <laughs> so I go downstairs. This is what I see. Isla, my baby is naked, which isn't weird because apparently one time I told her, sometimes you got to let your shit breathe. <laughs> oh, uh, God. We only know that because that's what she told the preschool teacher. <laughs> Yeah, on the yeah. swing set, in a dress, just airing her shit out, just <sighs> for JJ. Teacher's like, oh, Isla, honey, where are your panties? She just hops off. Sometimes you gotta let your shit breathe. Definitely hit kid. Isla's in the rock. Isla, Isla's naked. George is in the rocking chair, laughing hysterically. And our dog's sitting in between them like, I don't fucking know. <laughs> so I come in, I'm like, hey, guys, it's really early in the morning. Mommy and I are still sleeping. What could possibly be so funny? George gets in my face and goes, Daddy, you got to see baby Isla's new trick. It is hilarious. I said, what is it? She goes, no, I don't want to spoil it for you, Dad. You got to see it. Isla, show Daddy the trick. So Isla, my baby the lunatic, the naked one, real quick, real quick, takes her finger and shoves it up her ass. Don't fucking judge me. What? You think I was ready to parent oh, that? It's five in the morning. God. You think you could have parented it? The super nanny couldn't have stopped it. And now it's in there. As a parent, I kind of want to see the second part of the trick. She takes it out of her ass and puts it in the dog's mouth. Now, hey, 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 fuck you. I saw it, okay? I'm just telling you about it. I, I was like, what the fuck is wrong with you two? What are you guys, Germans? Oh, God. New rule. We do not put our fingers in our butts and then put them in our animal's mouth. I can't believe I'm saying this. <laughs> Georgia gets on my face and goes, Calm down. It's funny. You just don't get it. <laughs> <laughs> what? What part of that trick is funny, Georgia? She didn't even miss a beat. She goes, "We've been doing it all morning." <laughs> <laughs> and the dog doesn't know it's poop, Dad. I'm like, "Fuck it, do it again." They do it again. The dog comes right back. Like, what's on the finger? What's on the finger? Oh, it's shit. What's on that finger? What's on that finger? <laughs> Poor dog. So an hour later when my wife woke up, I'm like, you got to see baby Alice's new trick. <laughs> God. Yeah. She's like, what is it? And I was like, I don't want to spoil it for you. <laughs> you got to see it. Isla, show mommy the trick. And Isla just goes to town. Wham! Wham! My wife's like, what the fuck is wrong with you? I'm like, give it an hour. It gets funnier. Wow. The dog doesn't know it's shit. No, watch the dog. It's a rescue. It's fine. Oh my god. Wow. Um, that was uh, Bert Kreischer talking about his daughters. Holy crap. Um, must have been wild to have him as a dad. I'd like to, I'd like to see how those kids are today. Um, as Isla, uh, she sounds like a piece of work. She sounds like she's going to grow up and be quite interesting. Um, wow. Um, that video was originally put together and put up by Comedy Zone. Um, everybody go check them out. And yeah, another wild st story from Bert. Um, crazy kids, but look where they came from. So I, I have a feeling their teenage years are just going to get wildly interesting for him. Um, but, I mean, what can he say? I mean, some of his stories, he's got craziness to look forward to. Um, yeah, always fun. Uh, with that, if you guys out there have any other videos or anything you want me to check out, uh, funny, weird, strange, feel free to put it down in the comments. Always looking for new stuff. Uh, like and subscribe. It's free. It helps me out. And uh, once again, until next time, thanks for watching.